friends, I am Yerna Demon you are watching Lolly Animal TV. We bring you the best daily animal videos that you will definitely like. Subscribe to our channel and get information about animals, then go for free. Let's start today's video. 17 Amazing Facts About the Rock Kestrel The Rock Kestrel, Falco rupiculus, is a bird that belongs to the kestrel group in the family of falcons called Falconidae. This bird of prey species was actually considered a subspecies of the common kestrel, Falco tinunculus, and is still known by many as Falco tinunculus rapiculus and Falco tinunculus interstictus. The rock kestrel is found in Africa and is the most common among the falcon species of the world found in southern Africa. In Africa, rock kestrel is found in northwestern Angola and Congo to south Tanzania and then towards the south to South Africa. The bird is found in a wide variety of habitats that include open areas through rocks, arid areas, and semi-arid areas. There is less distribution of these kestrels in the north along with northeast Namibia, southern Mozak kestrel live. The rock kestrel, Falco rupiculus, can stay anywhere they want to because of their flight habits. The falcon, rock kestrel habitat includes hilly, and rocky areas flying over the ground and living in trees. What is a rock kestrel's habitat? The rock kestrel range map includes the south of Africa where the bird occurs naturally. In the south part of Africa, the kestrels are found in northwestern Angola east of the southern Democratic Republic of Congo and the south of Tanzania, and then south to South Africa. The bird of prey is quite common in South Africa, Namibia, Botswana, Lesotho, Swaziland, and central Mozambique. Sources have found the birds generally staying in the southwestern part of the range during the breeding season. The rock kestrel migrate often as in the breeding season, the birds stay in the south and west, but after the end of the season, the birds sometimes move towards northeast to Botswana, northeastern South Africa, and Zimbabwe. You may sometimes find a scarcity of these birds in the north and northeast and eggs are laid by the female and the female alone takes part in the incubation which lasts for around 27 to 31 days. During these days, the male feeds and protects the female, and when the young hatches, the male generally cares for the young too. After 30 to 36 days of birth, the young fledge. What is their conservation status? The conservation status of rock kestrel, Falco rupiculus, is not mentioned by you can red list. The common kestrel or Falco tinunculus is categorized as least concerned by the Yukon red list currently due to the abundance of the bird in its natural habitats. Even the rock kestrel was earlier considered a subspecies of Falco tinunculus and is known by many researchers still by the scientific names Falco tinunculus rupiculus and Falco tinunculus interstictus. Going by the distribution and the abundance, there is currently no threat to the species. It is important to keep a lookout for the species as although there is no direct threat, Conservation is very much necessary for the rock kestrel. Rock kestrel is commonly found in many protected areas. The common kestrel speed is around 39 miles per hour, 63 kilometers per hour, and the rock kestrel flight will be the same as it was considered a subspecies of the common kestrel. How much does a rock kestrel weigh? The rock kestrel, Falco rupiculus, males have a weight between 0.4 to 0.56 pounds, 183 to 254 grams, and females have a weight between 0.41 to 0.61 pounds, 190 to 280 grams. What are the male and female names of the species? The rock kestrel male and rock kestrel female are not given different names. They are known by their common name and scientific name, the rock kestrel, Falco rupiculus. What would you call a baby rock kestrel? A rock kestrel baby is called a young. What do they eat? The rock kestrel diet small birds, mammals, lizards, arthropods, and more, and the bird hunts from a high perch and sometimes even by hovering to spot the prey. The diet is quite wide. 